No, kiss my ass. I'm not getting another picture for this. We're going to use the same picture I used the last time. Well, last week when I did this, the first episode review. So, let's get into this episode and break down the details. So, this is a Randy Marsh episode. And he's my number one favorite character out of all the South Park characters. Because he, he is funny as shit. Trey Parker and Matt Stone did it, like, a really good job writing to this character, man. Baseball fights, him being a chef, etc. So, man, it, like, it's, it's funny shit he does. <laughs> like, it's, it's fucking hilarious. And now he runs this uh, farm called Tegrity Farms. It's like a, a weed farm selling marijuana and stuff like that. And it's, it's been going on for a while, for a couple of seasons now. And, like, in the beginning... I don't know. I never really watched the beginning of it, of the Terry Farms thing. I remember like some things about it. He, him, and Tali run it, stuff like that. But in this episode, he's at a, a conference with other weed sellers, and this guy was on the stage on the podium telling about different race that are better than uh, white people sell it better than white folks sell weed, <clears throat> and it's not doing the same for for white for white sellers who sell weed. And Randy ha has come up with an idea to get more uh, sellers. So he decided to have a family meeting with his family, the Marsh family, and talk about uh, we need more black community, we need more black people to, to buy our weed and stuff like that. And he, and he asked Stan about to Token and stuff like that. So Stan goes to talk to Token and invite his parents over for dinner and. Stay, Randy started talking to uh, Token's dad about uh, this and that, about weed. And this is something totally new what happens here in this scene. So what happened here is that uh, what's name? Randy asked Token's dad about where did the name Token come from. He was like, oh, why do you ask? He was like, well, it seems kind of odd to have a name like Token. Well, what are you thinking? You say you think you say something. Think it's like a, some kind of racist thing. But the thing is, Token. Then he named his son Token after J.R.R. Tolkien, the writer of Lord of the Rings, because his dad's a big fan of Lord of the Rings. So it's actually spelled Tolkien with an L instead of Token. I don't know what's going on with that. I think it's because I don't know, but fucking. Uh, Twitter people complain about it. Fucking liberals complain about that. About Token's character. His name's Token. So I, I don't know what happened with that. It seems kind of a little odd. Now, now out of out of, out of all <clears throat> out of all twenty five seasons, now they bring up about Token's name. I mean, it's it's funny, but it's just now they do it after all these seasons. Now they now they talk about Token's name. So he's talk to him about it and Stan's like really his name's actually Tolkien said Tolkien so he decided to call Kyle up on the phone about it he's like hey Kyle and he talked to him about it Kyle's like yeah I knew that already dude and he decided to call Cartman up and he talked to Cartman about it he was like do you know his name's actually Tol Tolkien said Tolkien's like what dude that's gay I didn't really now I'm surprised to hear Cartman say gay because this generation is a bunch of pussies and they can't handle words like that well, I still laugh my ass always. Like, oh, that's gay. I was like surprised because this generation sucks. So that's why you said that's gay. I guess you can still say that in television shows, I guess. Huh. Okay. But anyways, yeah. I was like, I was surprised. I was like, I was surprised about that. I, was, I started laughing my fucking ass off. So then later on, it's like, Stan's like the only person that didn't know that Tolkien's name is actually Tolkien. Based off... J.R.R. Tolkien, the guy that wrote Lord of the Rings. So later on, you know, Randy got, you know, Tolkien's dad working for him on the farm and stuff like that, how to work together. And they compare each other to like Ben and Jerry, the ice cream maker guys, two gay ice cream maker guys. And Randy's basically just using him. He's not really just going to actually do things with him. He's just actually just using him so he can get more customers to come there because he's black. So. That's basically what it is. So, got the whole thing going on with that, and then you got fucking Stan going to the, you know the doctor to talk to the doctor about Tolkien's name being Tolkien.
and Stan tells the doctor that he thought his name was Tolkien instead of Tolkien. Doctor flips out and calls him a piece of shit. Then he points at the fans at the screen saying, you guys are pieces of shit and think his name is Tolkien instead of Tolkien. What the fuck is going on here? Like I said, I have all seasons and now now they bring this up and they start now they start saying it as racist to have his name be Tolkien instead of, his name should be Tolkien instead of Tolkien. Like I said, what really, like a bunch of liberals got mad about the character Tolkien or something? Like I, I don't get it. I, I think I think there was I think it was some about, about some article about that. I think I'm not 100 percent sure, but I think a bunch of fucking liberals complain about it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just I'm just guessing. I'm not 100 percent sure. So after that scene, fucking um, Randy and uh, what's this, uh, Tolkien's dad, you know, they're, they're working together. Well, I mean. Well, yeah, working together, you could say. Quote, unquote, working together. Tolkien's dad, Tolkien's, dad, Tolkien's dad is just standing there. He's not really doing anything. It's just Randy and uh, Tolloway. Tolloway just selling shit instead. He's just standing there just for, you know, diversity. So he just stands there. Blah, blah, blah. Stan does a bunch of research about, uh, well, Tolkien, J.R.R. Tolkien. He started reading books about it. About uh, J.R.R. Tolkien, Lord of the Rings, stuff like that. He started reading books about it with, with uh, fake ass glasses. And he came, came in the fourth, fourth grade class to talk to the, the students about it. And everybody already knew already. Uh, fucking Stan got mad about it. Then later on, fucking, uh, what's his name? Uh, like I said, later on, Randy Tolly get high in the shed. And Tolkien's dad comes in. Tell about I got some brand new ideas, and Randy and Tolly thought that shit is dorky because it's a bunch of Lord of the Rings crap, which I agree is pretty dorky. And they got in a fight with each other. Tolkien's dad got mad, saying he just using him just for be a token because he's black. He creates diversity and makes more customers come because he makes more customers because he's a black community and stuff like that. So that happened, and he leaves, and Tolkien's dad leaves, he's mad, Randy's like, you know, his, his voice doesn't sound like a black guy, which later on his voice changes to a black guy out of nowhere, which we'll get to that later. So yeah, then later on, fucking now, Stan's talking to the whole class, when there's a whole class in, in, in uh, the gymnasium, the, every every uh, grade, he's talking to everyone in the gymnasium about it. But, Tolkien's name being Tolkien, and every, the whole class knew. Stan got pissed off. Talking about the Lord of Rings was all these artifacts about Lord of Rings, stuff like that. He, he didn't. Uh, he asked Tolkien to come down to talk to everybody about it. And Tolkien comes on the microphone and he says that I hate the Lord of Rings. The Lord of Rings sucks ass. My dad's just a fucking nerd. Blah 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 blah. I'm not a fan of that. I hate my name. And he drops the mic and leaves. The next scene, fucking, uh, I said, Tolkien, Tolkien comes over to talk to, uh, Stan about it, and things happen, and he's like, Stan tells the truth about his name, he thought his name was Tolkien instead of Tolkien, and he's like, what, really, you really thought that? Yeah, I know, it's messed up. And he was like, alright, I forgive you, because my dad is across the street, and he's selling weed. So like, what, really? And they're all like happy with each other until Randy found out he was pissed off and he gets in a fight with uh, Tolkien's dad outside of the outside of the street. So then another neighbors and they're both selling weed and they go against each other. And now Tolkien's dad actually talking like a black guy now instead of a, a white guy. I think once again they had to change the character again because they can't have a white guy voicing a black guy. Because you know what happened to Cleveland Brown? Murder, murder on. Seth MacFarlane's friend used to voice him, he was white, he was, he was voicing a black guy. Now they changed that voice. And now they ask him, is that some fucking beef with each other, blah 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 blah. Then the, the doctor pops on the, on the screen and tells people, you're a piece of shit if you think his name was Tolkien instead of... You think his name was is Tolkien instead of Tolkien. And the episode ends. And what I think about this episode, I thought it was pretty funny. I mean, until like later on, it started to like, I don't know. It's like the ending part is just like, okay, so they're gonna have this continuation thing where these two have a beef with each other. And it's gonna, gonna continue on and on and on. 
Uh, here we go again, the whole continuation episodes again. I don't understand why they like doing continuation episodes like it's a video game or something. I remember somebody mentioned that in the comment section on YouTube, uh, one of my videos. They say South Park's like a turn to like the stick of truth or fractured by a whole video game or something. Instead of being actually an actual South Park episode. I don't get that why why they why they're doing that. The whole continuation thing. It should be just just one and done like it always been in the in the past. I guess things change. Well for the for the bad. Yeah, like most time I was laughing my ass on this episode. The thing is I like this episode way more than the first episode. The first episode first episode sucked ass. This actually uh, was a fucking upgrade from the first episode. Pajama day. But still, I, I find this whole, you know, token thing, you know, the whole thing with him being, uh, whole thing with token, like, now all of a sudden now it's like a bad thing to say about his name now all of a sudden. Like, what the fuck? And the whole thing with token's dad now, now his, dad, now his dad's voice is actually a black guy's voice now. I don't know what's going on with that. I think I think a bunch of liberals complained, and now South Park had to change it or something. The creators of South Park had to change it. I like, guess what happened or something. I don't know. It's weird. Now, now after 25 seasons, now now they decided to change things around. Now now Tolkien's name is actually Tolkien now. Said Tolkien. What? Because he's based off uh, his name is based off of Lord of the Rings uh, writer and creator. I don't know, I just find that stupid. Now all of a sudden now they just change everything around. And and I'll tell you, uh, Trey Parker's voice really aged for Stan, I'll tell you. His voice like really, really aged. He sounds more like an eighteen year old then, you know, uh, I think I think Stan's like like twelve, thirteen now in the show. It's, it's the reason they're still in fourth grade though. Yeah, that's I find that strange. The, the characters are still in fourth grade and they never moved up. They're still in like the same grade. After like so many seasons, they're still in like the same same grade. In the early seasons, they're like they're like in third grade. And afterwards, they went to fourth grade and just thought of that. So they couldn't actually move them to fifth grade or anything like that. You just leave them to like the fourth. Okay. Yeah, his voice really aged a lot, Trey Parker, because you know he is getting older. So that makes sense why Stan sounds a lot older because uh, the act the voice actors get old. I think they're in their 50s now, by, by a chance, if I remember. Late 40s, mid 50s, somewhere around there. That's what I'm guessing how old they are. Let's see, let me look Trey Parker here. 52, okay, yeah, so yeah, they're, he, they're in their 50s. So, the voice is like really aged. You know? Yeah, it's just this. This episode is, yeah, it's a lot better. It's a, it's a lot better than the first episode by a mile. It's a lot better, like ten miles better. But this whole episode is like some kind of thing against Token's name out of, out of the blue. Now it's like twenty five seasons in, and all of a sudden now they talk about Token's name being racist and it's wrong to say his name, say, say his name Token instead of Tolkien. I, I don't get that. I'm just not a big fan of the whole Tegrity Farms idea. I'm just not, not really a big fan of the idea because it's just, I don't know, it's very weak. I find to be the whole joke of it, I think. Like I said, Ray Marsh is like my favorite character out of all software characters, so I never one favorite, but the idea with, with, with him and Talawi, this and that, it's just, I feel like it doesn't really work. I mean, it's, it's kind of funny, but at the same time, it doesn't really work that well to me. Like I said, it's been going on for like a couple of seasons now, the whole Tegrity Farms idea that Trey Parker and Matt Stone came out with. And, I don't know. I don't know. But, now, now it's going to continue to the next episode. So you have our continuation between those two, have a beef with each other. Maybe it'll be, maybe it won't be like that. Maybe it'll be a totally different episode, but they still have a beef with each other in that episode. I don't know what's gonna happen in the next episode. Episode three is gonna be. We'll see what happens. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'll do a review on it. We'll see. But I'll say this episode is like a lot better than the first episode. That first episode was terrible. It's like it's like the worst way to start off the first season. Not the first season. <laughs> the first season. What is it? Nineteen ninety-seven. 
uh, the, the start off the 25th season I met. <laughs> oh, shit.